Hey there guys and gals, welcome back to my playthrough of DC Universe Online, and welcome to episode 6. And if you guys have watched from episode 5, we just have beaten uh, Queen Bee, and right now, as you can see from our mission, Oracle has given us a chance to visit the Watchtower. So, we're going to head to the Watchtower and... You know, she's going to show us around and get us caught up with what we need. And then we could probably go on to our next missions here. Uh, this is a good mission just to get your EXP going, flowing. So, this is a... And it's probably critical for you guys to do anyways. So, okay. So, the first... Pretty much this mission is, is you go around and she teaches you what each area is about. And that's pretty much it. This is it. Easy EXP, EXP. and yeah, so that's it. And once we are done with, uh, let's see, journal, once we are done with this mission here, what I like to do is actually go to these level 6 missions here, and it's just like that for every mentor. Once you open up uh, the watchtower, you get, you know, the other person's uh, missions. So, if you're not part of, you know, if you're Wonder Woman's, uh, if Wonder Woman is your mentor, it opens up Queen Bee and Bane. If you're, you know, Batman's, Batman's your mentor, it opens up uh, Demons and Loose, and which is Raven's mission, and the Queen Bee. So, everybody gets these missions. So, what I like to do is actually start from the lowest one and move up. And usually, you know, I'm not a big fan of the Bane mission, so I usually like to go to Demons is Loose first because I don't know, I just, I just can't stand that gloomy looking Gotham. Even though I love Batman, but Gotham is gloomy. Uh, so, Superman, the meta and for, for this you. part here, yeah, like I said, it's boring. Like yeah. Talking. I wish you could skip it, but you can't. Um, there is uh, investigations in here, so, and I'll show them as I go through. I usually collect them when every time I hit a new section of, you know, the part of the watchtower. So here's the first one. And I do have a quick question. Um, if people would like to answer or give me thumbs up or thumbs down for it. Do you guys like my intro heritage. that I usually put down? Um, I just think for me at least was putting out these videos a lot to be a little just quicker. I would Watch like to just, to you know, meet put them all together and just need. put them out but instead of having to JLA make that intro. And I know it's short, but it takes a while because you have to cut through, you know, gear. certain Our amount of video. I mean, just imagine episode cost. 5. It was about, what, 30 something minutes? And it's just a pain in the butt to get through around, you know, all that stuff. So, uh, I want everybody to at least thumbs up or thumbs down if you guys like the intro. You know, thumbs up if you guys like the intro. Thumbs down if, you know, you don't mind if, you know, I get rid of it. So, that's all I want to say. And, uh, hmm. I do have another one. Uh, would you guys like some more DayZ videos? I started playing a lot, and I'm still not, you know, a pro at it. I'm still a noob at it. So, you know, pretty much if I start from a fresh character, I would probably just record from there and go on and, you know, whatever, you know, get supplies and whatnot, try to survive. Welcome but to uh, I want I want to know if you guys want to see some more Daisy videos. I uh, would like to make some, but we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm too busy, caught up with <laughs> with everything, so I want to try to I want to try to work on different products, you know, different videos, different games too, and mostly with Sleeping Dog. And is this Sleeping Dog coming out next or this coming up week? I can't remember. It's either it's one of the Sleeping Dogs. Darksiders 2 and what was the other one? Um, if you really want Darksiders crime, 2, I want to say maybe. Clues oh, Transformers. Investigations, collections, and um, to I want to fight. Probably want. I probably will get though one at least one of those out of the three. So I'll probably do some videos for that. And I have started 
doing a little bit of live stream. So, uh, you know, if you guys want to catch me on live stream, just search up Omega, and I'll put that on down in my link to a link for in the uh, you know the info section down there. So, okay, so I just talked to Huntress, and she's just telling me, you know, oh, go find an investigation. Will you? All, will I'll give you free XP. So here we go. Yay! And we'll get this investigation out of the way too. Uh, there we go. And just go back Oracle to her. That hollow token represents I think you only get like three or four hundred EXP, but yep. that's totally That'd fine. Be clue. See how many you can bring in, and I'll let the question know you're on the case. She's not much of one for crowds, so just check your email. Happy hunting. Alright. Uh, do we even get EXP for that? I'm not sure. It's been a while. Welcome to the heart of the Watchtower. This is where the Martian men so, yeah. to determine so this is our pretty much from data in the this mission world. here. It's the is quite also boring. I got really nothing to talk about. <laughs> I know this is supposed to be a commentary, but with this mission, I got really Superman have don't have anything to ex you know, explain. Only official so Justice League members can enter just the enjoy hall. the awesome Watchtower. Mm, there we go. This is the Watchtower War Room, our state of the art. And this area right here. Talk to Beast Boy you can actually buy to simulator where you if can practice you guys have played this game. And if you know if you're starting to play this game, this area right here actually gives you all the items for from the beginning when you make your character. So if you know, if you found an item that you liked from the beginning, but you know it didn't look too good for on your character at first, you know you could come down here and buy them. And a little secret, the uh, knock knock, it's uh, a good way to get uh, collection styles because if you after a while you collect maybe you know 100, 200, 300, 400, I don't, I can't remember what they are. I know the first one is like 10, and the second one's 50, and then third one's 100, then this one that like. 200 and I know there's I think the last one's at 500 so anyways it's a good way to go and collect styles I think you should be able to my brother told me I don't remember if my brother said it or not but it doesn't work like that anymore I'm not sure so uh, we'll see what happens but yes you do get uh, you know collections for that for styles so it's a good way to pick up you know uh, styles for your character and in here, we have PvP stuff. It's pretty much just your tier. Actually, you're, you're not your tier. I uh, so one of them Star holds your, you know, your first set of PvP Watchtower. gear for when you first hit level 30. So if once you hit level 30, Hawkman get over here and buy this gear. Plus, you'll get the whole set, and it nets you 10 uh, points too. So come over here, get that. You do have your PvP weapons here too. Uh, these are the, the higher tier ones, the ones that you know you get at level 30, uh, right from the start. Uh, you know it's in the one same one with all the, you know, uh, armor there. So, and these are a little t higher tier. They actually changed, lowered everything I should say from the weapons. They used to be, I think they used to be 120 conquest points before they got did ditch that, to uh, mark the tactics. And they knocked it down to 55, which, oh my gosh, it's so much better. <laughs> so you don't have to spend so much time. And then this one is your know, Marks of Legends. Uh, uh, you can use them for getting these characters here. You know, Robin, Two-Face, Joker, blah, 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 blah. Uh, once you, you know, even if you lose, you get one. But when if you win, you get two. So, you know, always try to win. But, you know, losing is, you know, losing is not that bad. But once you get enough for that, go there and buy them. And then if you collect all of them, I think you get 50 points for that too. So don't miss out on that. And with this thingy here, it lets us... And you get a free mission here and free XP too. So try not to miss that one. Uh, this thing here I won't talk too much about because you really don't need it until uh, maybe even higher, you know, getting your T3 things. Uh, but 
these are pretty much you know you take your exabytes and turn them into exabits and then you you know turn them into uh, mods for your what uh, your armor. So and that well I'll just go there and that's hey, pretty much it. So we Me talked to can. this guy and he'll give us a few mods Cadmus. and a few and plants you and you need plants to make mods so and, and they drop from bosses and the higher the boss the more the, the you know the more rare the you uh, the plans are so you know the higher tier the plans are so yeah and let's get this done. And let's just use them. Because they are a lot, so. Da -da 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 -da. So, how's everybody enjoying these videos so far? I would like to give them out quicker, but there's just a lot of things I have been doing, so. Uh, I haven't gotten a chance to do it yet, you know, trying to get these out. And they're pretty much running like 30, 40 minutes. So I I'll, I want to try to get them out quicker, but it just takes a little longer than I thought it would be. <laughs> but uh, hopefully now, you know, mostly with actually I've been watching Olympics, so <laughs> that's the really the real reason why I've been doing these vid videos. I've been trying to keep up with the Olympics, and with that done, and it doesn't help that all these games are coming out at the end of August. And so, <laughs> with Madden coming out, yay! And then with, uh, I don't know if I, uh, I don't know if I want to get Guild Wars 2 though. I know my cousin wants to get it, but I've been, I'm a regular on game trailers, and I've been hearing that from the uh, test servers or the stress test servers, and that a lot of people are having problems with the, you know. They're uh, running, you know, pretty badly on their computers and whatnot. So I'm, I'm a little iffy on that. My PC isn't that great, and you know, hopefully by it's the 28th, Oracle. that's when it comes that out. So hopefully by then, you know, they'll be all and fixed and whatnot. And and I will, yeah, I'll probably get it anyways, like but Batman. we'll see what happens. So this will be the last mission, you know, the last little mission here for the Watchtower. So. We finally get to leave the tower the here. Area. And that area right there the it lets you reset your points satellite. for this is where we you know Star Labs so you know like I said I don't know if I said this already but don't worry your about skills your, your skills edge. and powers once you get to wash tower here you can reset them as much as you like. They do go up and uh, let me just go over here real quick. Let's see how much it costs for the first one. Uh, there we go. Resetting trace costs 500 and then my current balance is 635. Uh, before the update, you used to be able just to, you know, reset both your powers and skills. And as a guy who, I don't know, my main character only has about 65 skill points. Uh, I'm, you know, there's people with 100, so so I feel sorry for them. But, you know, with all that skill points you put into your weapons and whatnot, it just takes forever. And I love that new update where they actually let you reset you know your power or your skill points or both of them so uh... that just makes it so much better uh... i don't even know where i left off here um, oh yeah let's do this one let's try to get all the skills for um... martial arts here mostly my range skills they work pretty good so uh, let's go to this last area here will be the magic wing and we have the statues here of our heroes, our main heroes, Wonder Woman, Batman, and the Supes. So, and they all have their own little wing here. So and this is the Magic Wing. You know, Batman has the Tech Wing. Uh, Superman has the mate, uh, the Metal Wing. So, and each one has their own T1, T2 suits. And this is the last one. I think it's the last one. Yes. Awesome. Oracle here. That hollow token okay. shows the, oh, where am I going? Okay. the magic so wing. Magic users with this connect to the mystical forces of the universe. Done. These heroes are mentored by Wonder Woman and work Let's with the sentinels of magic. Let's go do the demons on the loose. 
Um, it's in Metropolis, but it's in the Chinatown section. So we will be using this teleporter. And everyone has a different teleporter. And you can tell, and it shows up right there. Metropolis, Chinatown, that's uh, from the Magic Wing. The Little Bohemia is from the Meadow Wing. And East End is in, oop, it's in uh, Gotham. Uh, it's in the Tech Wing, so. Uh, so let's get this done here. I don't know how fast this will be. I might go a little bit over uh, what I want <laughs> my target time is. Uh, I don't know if I will split this up, but if I do, you'll see two parts to this. Uh, let's talk to Zatanna. She actually gives you two Amazon missions. Uh, she gives you the level, I think, 12 one to the So, the yeah. So, they can be so it's just that you a little bit more XP. But we want to do the protecting... Uh, what's it called again? I don't keep track of their names. So it just turned into Raven's Unleashed. So as you can tell. Um, uh, no spoilers, I guess. We'll, we'll wait until we get there. I know I said it you know, a few minutes ago, but hopefully you guys forgot about it. But let's get there. And once I get out here from this loading screen... Uh, Every beginning city has their two races, so go ahead and you know get them done. Uh, I won't do them for saving us time here. Uh, so yeah, so every city has two, and then after you complete all of them, all the t uh, so six races, I think you get 20 points because you get one for beginners, completing three beginner races and one f for another one. So. But uh, this mission is pretty close here. Just a heads up, villains' missions is right here. So watch out if you're on the PvP server. Watch out for the villains there. And hopefully, no one's a jerk and you know a level 30 villain will just sit here and wipe you guys out. We had that so many times. Luckily, I picked a PV server. So. Magic shop in Metropolis. We try okay, so the side mission here is right under rituals. this bridge here. So, oh, oh, you got an exit bit over here too. So yeah, the side mission is under this bridge here, and what it is just collecting the Soul Reaver horns. So Soul Reavers are the actually ones that look like demons. These guys. Whoa. Let's get this done quick. A wolf form. Don't mess with me in my wolf form. Let's take these out one by one. So like I said, I've been playing too much Daisy, and you know that's that Olympics has been garnering my time. So um, with Olympics done, it should open up a time slot for me to get some DCU all going. Uh, so hopefully we can get more videos, you know, roll in here, and you know try to get to level 30 as quickly as possible. So you know these tutorials will help people out. And I know it's been about two, almost, I think it hasn't been about two years already. Oh, no, two years would be hitting, uh, has it been two years? I can't remember. Almost three, I guess. Or almost two. Uh, that one should be, you know, coming up soon here. So, <coughs> hopefully, you know, we still have people playing. And nobody's giving up on the game yet. It doesn't look like it. You know, during peak hours, it's still pretty full, but, like I said, uh, this game is a little easier than a lot of the MMOs I play, so, uh, you know, at least from, you know, leveling up, uh, this game's all about questing, so I'm not a big fan of questing. I come from, you know, the Final Fantasy 11 days, where <laughs> all you really do is, uh, less, you know, EXP for levels. And this game's a little different. Uh, it's pretty much a f you know fetch quests, you know fetch this, get this, get that, kill this, kill that. Uh, it's still a little different from what I use. I'm used to playing so. 
but uh, like I said, I've stuck around since uh, the starting, since it launched. So you know, I'm one of those guys who bought bought into this hype, and I still like it just because I'm a big superhero fan. Yeah, you know, I'm a big superhero nut, so I love you know my comic books, and uh, you know the world is pretty good. I, I like it, and you know that's just my opinion in this game. Uh, but ew, with Sword Tour coming out as free to play, I think in November. I don't know. Uh, I like to be a Jedi too, so I might go into that. <laughs> I don't know yet. So I know I definitely know what I would uh, play it, but I don't know if I'll be paying for it, like this game. Uh, I just lost my legendary membership because I'm like, eh, I haven't played it in a while, so I'll give this month up and, you know, just do, since I'm doing this video too, so, uh, I won't be buying a legendary membership yet until maybe another month or two. We'll see what rolls by and hopefully by that time I, we should get a new DLC. I think it's supposed to be every two months, so maybe in September or October we'll be seeing, uh, new DLC and hopefully we get new powers uh, but yeah um, and we just got a new update uh, for DCO over here and actually let's see right here real quick what we got left oh we finished both of them okay so we just got some new uh, updates uh, for gadgets and mentals. So, uh, and they were given new. They were given new, you know, powers and animations, which I like. I've been playing the mentalist role, and my my brother hasn't touched the uh, gadgets. I might hop on just to play his gadgets character, but uh, mentalist. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember me saying that they aren't that great. <laughs> for solo, uh, I'm gonna have to take that back. Maybe I was just not that good at it, but when I was playing it, I got my guy up to level 20, I think 24. Um, when I was playing it, it was you know pretty good. I I, I felt like they were pretty powerful. Uh, and like I said, maybe it was just me before you know being a pretty new person to the game Hello. and really an never touched anything other than healing. Lab. Characters, I found, I found it a little harder, but you know, playing it now, it it seems so much better. They seem like you know a lot better. The animations are awesome, so that is one thing. Okay, so as you saw right there, that is the side mission right here, and all it is just go to the citizen, and that's it. Um. Do watch out if there's villains around here because they have the same mission as you are. It's like it turns them, you know, the opposite way. So uh, with that, you know, it becomes pretty much a competition of who can grab these guys first. And I, I usually try to do this mission first just to get that done with. So, so my next, the next mission, the real mission, I can just hop on roofs and do that. Uh, let's get over here real quick. And this should be the last one. Okay. So, I'll be going on rooftops to finish off these missions here. Uh, these are a pain in the ass to do a bit. Just because. Ooh, new power. I haven't used that one yet. Just because it just. It, they just, you know. Just being on the rooftop. And when I just makes it a little, a little bit more troublesome. And the fact that if, just like every other mission, if you have people doing these, and it takes maybe uh, I want to say 30 minutes, uh, 30 seconds to maybe a minute for them to respawn, it just becomes a pain, pain in the butt to to get done. So, uh, let's get this mission done real quick here. It looks like there's not a lot of people around here, or at least hero boys. I just saw one. But down there, so I want you to spawn into a demon. There we go. There we 
go. Let's destroy these vortexes. And these things, these vortexes, do uh, spawn on, on those buildings over there. That one right there. And that one right there. So, you know, if somebody has taken these ones over here, go ahead and head over there. And grab those vortexes over there. And there is, I think, one more on this building here. Or maybe one or two. One, so... So it's not too bad. Uh, during peak hours, it's not that bad. So I like playing around this time. Uh, I don't know when. I think it's five o'clock right now over here in Minnesota. So I think uh, I want to say I got another hour before the server shuts down. So I should probably just do this mission and then <laughs> I should be good. Yeah, the server resets every every I want to say it's, I want to say six o'clock. I'm not 100 percent with that. It's sometimes I'm on and it's like six o'clock. Sometimes it's like five and whatnot. So uh, I think it's usually six o'clock over here when uh, the server server goes down for a bit, and it goes down for like I want to say 30 minutes. I should be almost done. You see there, there's one down there. Oh, come on. Right at the end, too. What? This here? Should be one more on the bottom there. I should. Let's go grab that one real quick. And then we're on to the next mission. Which is quick, too. Actually, the next one is a little. <laughs> it's a little tougher, too. Let's get this, let's get this before he changes. So we can run away. <coughs> Sorry for that. I just got itch my throat. Um. Wait a minute. Oh, there we go. I'm trying to raise Starfire and the other Titans, but right. no word since they went into the science. So this next area here, I'm it's a pain in the ass to do. Uh, just because if there's a lot of people, like I said, it's just like the same mission here. You have to destroy vortexes and all that and it takes you know thirty seconds for it you know twenty thirty seconds for it to respond so uh, but anyways side mission here you know get it done you know I love side missions first of all if you finish a certain amount of side missions they add up to your you know your uh, your feats so let's get this before it blows up um, so doing that, you know, will bet you 25 because it, it completes the side, a whole story arc. Blood priest so, uh, once you get that done, you get 25, this 25 feet points. And then, you know, doing that, I mean, if you have done everything, or most of everything, of what I'm doing here, you should have close up to, I want to say, um... Uh, Either like a low, a high 20. Oh my gosh, what the heck? Did I even hit that? Oh, I got it, yes. Uh, you should have a high 20s uh, skill points or a low 30s. I want to say around 32, maybe. Oh, shoot. Oh my gosh, there's people here. Yay. Yay for the fun. But yeah, uh, you will get around a. Little High 20s, you know, about 28, 29, maybe, and, you know, maybe you roll around 32, maybe, something. Oh, I don't want that. I want this one. Uh, so, yeah. Oh, come on. I had that. Oh, God. Oh, don't destroy the vortex there, please. I think he's just waiting for somebody. I think he's helping somebody level up. So let's get those before they they take it from me. So just yep, yeah, just go around here on the floor level here. If there's a lot of people. Um, 
Actually, there is, I think, three vortexes on the roof here. And I'll show it to you guys uh, once I get these to defend the paramedics here since I only need one more. Um, there we go. Oh, on level 12. Nice. Um, there's another one here. So yeah, there's about three of them up there. Um, try... You can use that as, you know, last resort only, because, like I said, they, these... The spawn time on these are pretty horrid. It looks like they're coming up here. <laughs> Let's get this done. Let's get this. Like I said, you probably won't see me use too much, too much powers, just because the wolf here itself is pretty strong. So, oh, I'm gonna got a range up. So, I don't think I didn't get it. But like I said, the wolf itself is pretty strong. So, unless I use uh, the R2 square, which gives me a uh, DOT damage, which helps out too. Mostly on bosses. So, try to just, you know. That's usually how I roll with things. With DPS. Oh, come on. And the spores. The DOT damage here are spores, uh, poison spores. And they do stack with. I'm pretty sure they stack with other. You know, other powers to I don't really I can't really you know I guess you know I'll take my word for it I guess I'm pretty sure it does but uh, we'll see what happens I don't think I have any other actually I do right here spores spores yep and they do stack so, so just watch for that and you know, try to stack as much DLT damage as you can. Makes the fight so much quicker and so much easier. Did I get all the vortex? Oh, one more. Let's head to the roof again. That one should have spawned already. Hopefully. Pop put a power point on here. There we go. So, this next mission here will be a ending mission, so we'll have a boss fight, and click these real quick. Raven fought her father's evil all her life. To have him possess her now must be uh, a living What do I have for plants here? A real one, since now all the titans are off calm. Thorn shield. Even Nightwing. Might go with a healing power here. Um... Uh, yeah, let's go with. Zatanna confirms that Trigon has possessed Raven utterly. This is give us spores. Yes. Hostage. You must free them and save yeah, Raven let's do shield, shield, uh, thorn shield here. Give us another poison spores. So let's head inside. The mis side mission is just right here. So you cannot the miss. Police it. took down some Gotham thugs trying to do business in Metropolis. Let's head into the eighth precinct here. And this first part here is just battled some demons. Pretty simple. Oop, wrong one. There we go. Did not want to heal myself. I wanted to use a uh, thorn shield. This up. And one of the side missions is right here. Part of the mission for the side. You know, hey, FPC for the side mission, easy. I guess. I ain't running. You know, with the R2 buttons, you kind of want to watch out because you might accidentally hit, you know, <laughs> the circle button, R2 circle, which uses your cola. So watch out for that. Might. Might not be a good idea to put that over there. So, and there's another one over here. Let's 
Let's get that done. So much for breaking out of this So, in this part here, we'll be fighting the, you know, the Teen Titans here. So, uh, that barrel in the back there, if you see that right there, that one pops up every time. Uh, so, you don't have to worry if your life gets slow. I would definitely just wait until your HP drops a bit and then use it. But, you know, you do whatever you will, so it eventually will go up. Oh, I hate Cyborg so much. Why heal, Cyborg? Why heal? It's almost done here. There we go. And then we got Starfire here. I wish you could get her hair. That would be pretty cool. They should have that as a viable item on, the, on their store. I like her hair. Yeah, like I said, I w oh, what the heck? Oh, I didn't hit it. Oh, I didn't hit it. Nope. Oh, there we go. Okay, <laughs> so Nightwing's next. Let's get rid of him quick. And he hits a lot. Let's tell you that. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, you got my attention. Okay, let's get this right here. We're gonna use it. We're gonna use it against Donna Charge. So. As you can see, we got an investigation right there. And destroy the Titans. Show me what you've got. Try to. Oh, I hate her, her last old truth. And it should be done right here. And now we got graphical glitch. Yeah! The inevitable is Let's grab this investigation right here. So, we're about halfway through uh, this mission. Uh, we should be done after, you know, um, a few more minutes. We just have uh, like a little bit of area to go through. Then we should be done here. Then don't forget about our side mission too, so. Oop, I thought I saw somebody right there. So it's a prisoner over here too, so go ahead and get it. My boss will get you for this. Come no further and <coughs> value your lives. Okay, so let's start open up once she's done with her dialogue. It opens up these trap demons that were behind this uh, wall of lasers. one seems to be broken. <laughs> and then opens up the other side too after you finish this side. Which I don't get. It's kind of weird that they put this in here. I I feel, I feel like this part's pretty useless. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Oh, it looks like these guys are broken. Oh, it makes my life a little easier. Okay, so we're done with this one. 
And we got one more section left. This one's just quick. Real quick here. And you, you do get a feat for killing, I think, 30 demons in here, so. And it'll be automatic, pretty much. So once you take out these guys over here. Should be one more. Or two more, I guess, eh? Booyah! You get a feat. And this guy's over here, actually. I usually avoid him for a bit. So, side mission done. All we have left is the boss. We have the timer here. Glad you guys showed up. I'm holding her body in one place, but Raven's fighting Trigon deep in her soul. I can feel it. What can we do? I've got to stay here to keep the portal open, but only a true magical warrior can enter that soul self. The second that happens, I'm teleporting everyone else out of here. It's all up to you. I know you and Raven can beat him down. <sighs> so, yep, this mission will be just pretty much uh, trying to take out Raven's darker self because Trigon is trying Raven to, you know, long. take over uh, her body. Her As you can see she from the, if you guys watch the Teen Titans uh, animated series on uh, Cartoon Network, uh, yeah. So you can see Trigon's right there. There we go. Somehow the, the voice work was a little low there. Um, you will have to use a barrel over there. There's a health barrel right there, so you can see it. I would definitely use that once because you have to fight three of them. So uh, try to kind of and it does respawn. So and there's another one over there. So but shouldn't be too bad if you're you know if you're first time playing it might be a little tough but uh but this mission itself isn't too bad mostly because you're already level 12 this is like a level 6 mission or 9 mission so it's like the same as uh you know queen bee so and once we're done with this we will fight that raven right here so Free hit. So pretty much, we'll be fighting the darker self of Raven. We do have her light side come help us out. So, but uh, just like every other NPC in this game, unless it's an FOS, uh, they are pretty useless. So, do what you want to do. Spam if you want to. Whatever you like, do it. And hopefully it drops her uh hopefully it drops her uh her hood. I want her hood. And I never get it, so why am I asking for it? <laughs> you don't know I think I started like I said, I started over I wanna say I have made maybe 20 or so characters over. I have gotten her hood once, I think. <laughs> that was all. That's only because I did, you know, at the end. Uh, and that was on my main character, and that was just once. And you know, my brother has played maybe five or six characters, and he's gotten maybe three so far. Which makes me a little mad. <laughs> I don't know why I get, you know, cruddy drops, but. I guess that's me. Now we know she can resist his evil with your help. So look for the mystic portal uh, out of there. There is an investigation over here, and this will end. This investigation. Woot woot. Dragon's Done. Evil still so I will end this Defense video here. 
and hopefully the video isn't too long. Um, this fight is far from over. Like I always say in every video, and I will you know, you like the con yeah, like the video, you guys like it, you know, thumbs it up. Uh, like I said from the beginning, you know, if you guys like the intro, thumbs it up. If you guys, you know, don't care about the intro, give it a thumbs down. It doesn't matter to me. You know, if I thought the intro it cuts me, you know, maybe, you know, three or four more hours, I could, you know, for for this uh, video to render. So, and it doesn't take too long to render this video, anyways. But, uh, you know, like the video if you guys like it. Uh, add me on PSN. Name is Omega Belmont, and I will put that in my descriptions. And I'll put everything in my description. You know, follow me on Twitter. Uh, you know, add me on Facebook if you guys want to, or drop by and just say hi. And you know, I'll try to put up some uh, live stream times. I usually try to do so. I'll be playing some PS2 games and whatnot. I'll be trying to play some PS3, but uh, my streams will probably be more PS2 on the PCS. PCSX2, so I'll be running it on emulator. Uh, but yeah, hopefully everybody enjoys it. And uh, this is Omega Belma, and I am out for tonight, or actually for today, <laughs> for this morning. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoy the video. Peace.